Hello and welcome. Uh, we're going to talk about trees and planting in a bit right here. Um, as you see here, this is a tree that uh, is self-made of a, a extrusions. And uh, as you see, it's quite nice uh, looking uh, tree. And for example, you can uh, change um, the transparency right here. You can put it to 60, click apply. And voila, there you have it. You can make it uh, looking very nice. I will show you guys how to make this tree step by step. And um, yeah, make a tree by yourself. So let's get into it. So the first thing that we're going to do is open a um, new uh, family. So, or make a new family, go to new family and then we go first for our generic model voila right here then open it and there you have it this is our uh, reference plane and we go straight to the front elevation and there uh, is a start where we uh, are going to model our tree of course so first things first we're going to make an um, extrusion to model our uh, trunk and right here we go to the uh, create app right here then for extrusion and now to save you guys some time I will paste it um, so I don't have to draw it in front of you I will delete those ones voila maybe those as well too and just connect them together voila then extrusion gonna set to five and minus five voila apply and there we go in 3d you see we have already our trunk of our tree and we go again to the front elevation the next thing that we're going to do is of course add some material so we can adjust it later in voila Click OK, voila, there we go. This is already what we have and it's our trunk. The next thing that we're going to do is of course uh, our leaves. Now the next step that we're going to do is of course our leaves. So we go again to create tab, then go for extrusion. And again, you can draw your tree, but I will uh, save you guys some time. I will uh, paste it of course, voila and then just click there somewhere then i'm gonna try to match it voila i think this will do but the arrow keys are moving it so it fits well voila there we go and again just click uh okay don't, don't mind that and right here you see still the same thickness then we're gonna go to finish voila and uh, go to 3d to have a look and there is our tree select those extrusion and again um, for the material uh, leaves voila there we go make it instance because we're gonna load it in later on and i will set it right here to instance also voila there we go and voila in the front view this is our very first steps to make a tree and now we're gonna load it in into the planting family and adjust it more so let's open uh, a new planting family right here new then go to family right here then we go gonna search for planting right here metric planting open it and now we are in the family as you see here in the view we have nothing because we didn't load it load anything in and now we're gonna load the tree in so we go to view then load into projects family tree okay and just place it wherever you want now we're gonna align it from here to and then search for the center somewhere out there voila and then also center don't lock it 
and also center it. Now, in our view, oh, we're going to search voila. ZA is a shortcut for uh, to get a view on your loaded family. So this is the family right here. We're going to do first our leaf trees right here and then uh, leaves tree type material finishes okay do the same for the trunk trunk tree type okay voila there we go and now uh, we're gonna get the tree some uh, of yeah make the tree some more volume so we go again to reference level and then we're gonna rotate it so arrow but then uh, we're gonna make sure this is on copy and then hit the space bar to rotate this side voila then we're going 90 then again rotate space bar center of it then 45 and this one we can mirror voila oh of course make sure copy is on mirror voila and this one i'm going to mirror also but not copy it voila and there we go now we're gonna have look in 3d so in view that's our tree and this is looking quite uh yeah nice actually what we want i'm gonna wrote mirror this one and just mirror it don't copy it and voila there we go gonna look in 3d ah uh, yes this is what i want so this is our tree that we have now in 3d and that's about it <laughs> so now we're gonna load it in into the into the uh project voila and then i'm gonna place my tree somewhere there and as you see here we have our um 3d uh yeah 3d extrusions and floor plan we don't want that well we're gonna fix this and we're gonna select those right here voila right here we go to uh, edit and then we say plan hide it okay load it in overwrite and it's gone so that's one uh, trick to do and as you see here we have our tree but we don't have the materials yet so i will select this tree in the type and i will copy it um, voila then right here we go to edit type and leaves click apply wait a minute and boom there we go now the same for the trunk here the trunk then again to our tree that we made voila and there we go you see that's how easily you can make a nice uh, looking tree but for the next thing that we're going to do is of course uh, on yeah floor plan we want some yeah tree circles well we go to the reference plane and then going to annotate tab right here again and fill it region voila we're gonna make a uh, circle like this voila then we're gonna go right here fill it region edit uh, we don't want it uh, masked so we're gonna use a model oh we have no pattern well, i will leave it like this then uh, we use cross voila and i will make it purple so we can see it better voila then go to finish and there we go i will make the cross hatch 
smaller, of course. Uh, go for one, one, apply, okay. Voila. Then we're gonna load it in. Override, and then, oh, <laughs> oh, this little, okay. <laughs> I see where my mistake is. So you go to back to the family. And right here, the scale is set on 120. We will set it to 150 and zoom more out, of course. And then make the circle uh, bigger. And I will change the units to centimeters. Voila, this is fine. Then we go for 50 or maybe 80. Let's start with 80. Let's click OK, load it in, and we will see how big it now is. And this is already, yeah, <laughs> better, of course. And we will make it, oh, wrong button. And we will make it a bigger for the sake of it. 150, let's go, load it in. Voila, and override, of course, and voila, there we go. We have our, um, yeah, our pattern uh, for our tree. Again, this is the same, um, yeah, work method, but yeah, different, um, yeah, different patterns. So uh, we go to our 3D, we have our tree again that we need to, yeah, set new materials because we did override parameters then just gonna copy it edit leaves apply okay again with the trunk in the type uh, yes trunk okay then in the type trunk voila there we go and voila we have our tree very uh, yeah very own tree and it's uh, looking uh, quite nice so uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video oh for one thing um, forgot almost forgot if we go to visibility graphics and we go for planting we can override it and 40 click apply and voila see how nice it looks in tra transparency and yeah, that's what you can do with the tree so i hope you guys enjoyed the video uh, subscribe and like and see you in the next one bye bye